Hey guys, welcome to my channel, or welcome back to it. Uh, I wanted to film a video talking about, uh, celebrities, singers, people throwing things at singers when they're live on stage recently. Because Tim McGraw just weighed in on it, which I never thought he would. I never thought this would become this high of a thing or this popular of a thing to where it feels like almost every single night an artist goes on stage somebody's throwing something uh, at them it just like boggles my mind like what I'm scared for it's like somebody's going to throw a knife on stage and it accidentally stabs the artist. Like... Double one. That's something I think... If you have knowledge in your fucking brain, which I know almost all of us do have knowledge in our brains, we know it's not right to do. Well, I think that's why people do are doing it. Because they get off on probably... The adrenaline of throwing things on stage because they like being in trouble or pissing somebody off and that like, gives them adrenaline or whatever. But that's not something to do, bruh. Like, everybody who's throwing stuff at people needs to fucking stop. Because you gotta cause artists to not want to go on tour ever again. Like, they choose whether or not they want to go or tour, everybody. Like, you do realize that, right? People, like, it's just something you don't fucking do. And, like, it's like every single time I read an article about somebody new getting something thrown at them. Kelsey Ballerini. Uh, Cardi B. Cardi B was, like, at her concert, she's like, you throw something at me, I will fucking kill you. That's what I would say, too, because, like, I'm gonna... I'm getting fed up with it to that point too where I would like threaten. It gets come to that point where I'm like getting pissed off because I don't want to be injured. I don't want to have to be sent to the hospital because somebody hit me with something. Like BB Rapsa was sent to the hospital. Well, no. She got like minor energy but she got very lucky. It's just like people need to stop throwing shit. Like go throw shit at a fucking wall. Not at people. That's something you just don't fucking do. Like, people should, like, be be getting arrested for their shit. That's what they should be getting... That's what... If that's not what's like happening, because I don't read what happens to the people. I haven't been. Because, like, I just get to a point... I'm just, I get to the point where I'm... I even know what I'm trying to say. I'm just, like, so fed up with it. Quit throwing things at people. Because what are you going to do if you accidentally stab someone and they fucking die because of it? Because you actually threw a knife and it stabbed them in the, in the heart and it killed them. You're probably going to get life in prison. But that could have not happened. Those, like, if you're mad at, a, at an artist, if, this, you, if, you, if you, they think they did something to you, find a way to talk it out. Find a way. Because there's a lot... There's a lot of ways talking it out can go very smoothly and very well. You don't have to go and almost kill somebody to do it. Injure somebody. To like, get something out of it. Like, it's not really what people are doing. Like, I am prepared tonight to see another... Headline that somebody else, that somebody threw something at, like, another artist. And it's just like, were you not taught respect? Because that's not someone's respect at all. It's not. Like, I'm scared for artists right now. I really, truly am. Like, I <laughs> think... Really am, because there was Bieber, Rexa, Cardi B, I got something through, thrown at her. Tell Sue Bellarini. Like, I could pull up all the artists that are having 
shit thrown at them. Whether it be a fucking drink or a fucking phone or whatever it might be, a book, for heaven's sake. Like, it's not right for what people are doing. It's not. At all. Like, I'm sick and tired. Ding. Okay, this is from the j14.com website. Okay. Bibi Rexa. That was the first one I've heard of. During a show in New York City in June 2023, Bibi was hit in the face with a cell phone by concert goer and received stitches. Thank God she was a okay. Okay, I haven't even heard about this one. Ava Matt. Ava was slapped in the face after an audience member rushed to the stage in Los Angeles in June 2023. She wrote on Twitter, He slapped me so hard that he scratched the inside of my eye. He's never coming to a show again. Oh, I would be livid. Kelsey Bellarini. Kelsey was struck in the eye with a bracelet while performing on stage in Idaho in June 2023. A fan account for Kelsey spoke out about the incident via Twitter, alongside the, alongside the video of the event. And guys, I know we all mean well. We all want to show Kelsey love the best way we know how. I saw her with all the gifts, but throwing things on stage where artists are already so vulnerable is not. In capital N-O-T, not the move. The account wrote, if you can't handle, if you can't hand it to her, there are so many other options. Lord, give it to us. Lord, give it to us. We will make sure he gets to her. But please, in capital, please, is all capital letters. Don't put her in danger like this. Again, I know you all mean well, but this has become a safety issue. We love you guys, we do, but please make it stop. I agree with every single fucking word that person this glad that read. Harry Styles. Seen this headline too. While performing at a concert in July 2023 in Vienna, Austria, Videos posted on social media appeared to show Harry wincing in pain and holding, in, and holding his head in his hands as he struck with an unknown optic while walking off stage. Now, say 14 only has four, four people that got hit. That email. I'm pretty sure there's more artists that have gone shit thrown at them. Like, I'm just fucking done with people getting attacked on stage like there's a line to see right around them that's completely capital letters w r o n g wrong like people just want somebody to get injured and it's just like i'm i'm I, i'm done okay it's only four people who've gotten in here then carney beat it okay maybe i'll just re-read re the headline long let me type in cardi Okay, this is from forums.com. Okay, no mind. Because I'm going to have to try my outlook girl. I'm going to read that one then. No, this is from abc7news.com. During Tosted at Cardi B on stage, he fires back with her microphone. Okay, I'm going to read this from word to word. Audience members at concerts in recent months have continued a pattern of throwing objects at artists who are on stage performing. Rapper Cardi B has had enough. On Saturday, the rapper was on stage at Dre, Dre's, Dre's, I think that's how you said, Beats Club in Las Vegas when an audience member appeared to throw a drink at her. Has seen in video, has seen in video footage posted to social media. In the clip, Cardi B is seen getting spill out, splashed with liquor, liquor from the cup while performing. Her 2018 hit, Bodak Yellow. Clearly upset, she reacted immediately by throwing her microphone as the crowd has to carry guards west to the stage. Marcy carry guards are seen, are then seen flocking to the person in the crowd house who walks from the stage before continuing on with her set. In another video posted on TikTok on Saturday, Cardi B is seen throwing her microphone at a DJ who appeared to call for song early during a performance at Dre's nightclub on Friday. CNN has reached out to a representative for Cardi B for comment. The incident in Las Vegas on Saturday is just the latest in a slew of similar scenes at concerts for artists, including Drake. Oh, I didn't even know Drake got in it. 
including Drake, Kelsey Bellarini, Harry Styles, and Mimi Rexa, have become the target of objects thrown, on, thrown at them while on stage, with some artists suffering injuries as a result. Only recently have performers including R&B singer Monica and country star Miranda Lambert gotten involved when they see behavior they do not approve of. Last week, Monica jumped off the stage after witnessing someone allegedly assault a female audience member in the crowd at, at her Detroit show. She was praised for interference when photos of the altercation went viral, viral on social media, and Selena told CNN, CNN's Abby Phillips she feels concerts have become a dangerous space and place. I just really want that to change, she added. Okay, I re- Drake. The ground type in Drake. The Canadian singer rapper was hit on a stage. Was hit on. Let me read that. This is from Deadline.com, by the way. The Canadian singer rapper was hit on the left wrist Wednesday night in Chicago while performing the song So Anxious. Drake looked at the phone on the ground but didn't indicate that he was injured or particularly annoyed. It carried all of the soap part of his. It's all a blur core. Oh, that really pisses me off. The all these fucking people think shit. Start out. Fuck this, drop it, people. Like, what is enough for me fucking enough, bruh? Like, I'm sick and tired of people getting sit thrown at them. Stop! It pisses me off. It really and truly pisses me off because what if somebody gets killed? What if somebody gets killed? Like, at Constraining Grammy's concert, she was shot and killed. I'm scared that that's gonna happen again. I'm scared of a lot of shit. Scared of the Oriana Grande incident that she had her concert happening. I'm scared of the incident that happened at Jason Aldean's concert to happen again. I'm scared for a lot of shit. It is sad that this is happening and it's also like maddening that this is happening. Like, have some re- fucking respect for artists. You obviously don't respect that artist and love that artist in the re- correct way. Because if you did, you wouldn't be throwing shit at them. You wouldn't be almost injuring them or injuring them completely. If you respected them. Like, it's done. G U N B capital D U N B dumb. And the Miranda Lambert incident with the girls taking selfies. I really don't want to talk about that because uh, I will say this and maybe not be a fan of her anymore because I'm on the side of actually I'll talk about it because obviously I'm talking about now. I'm with the people who are taking selfies out of fucking culture or video where we were doing. I'm on their side. Like, I immediately dropped Miranda Lambert. Like, I immediately, I immediately stopped being a fan of Miranda Lambert when that, I seen that headline and what happened. Miranda Lambert is in the wrong. And I don't think she's so, mmm. So clouded in her mind by this fame and what fucking ever. That she can't see a house is in the wrong. How do you not see that? Like as scared as I was. I'm never gonna go to a Miranda Lambert concert now. But if I was, she so would scream at me. That's what I'm terrified of. Because I'm taking a fucking video or photo. Like, it's so dumb. So, but uh, I am gonna end this video before it gets too long. Just learn how to respect artists. Just learn the definition of respect. Like, learn R-E-S-B-E-C-T. Find out what it means to me. Learn that. Learn that. Please do. But I'm gonna go. I'll see y'all in the next video. I just wanted to come on here and talk about it because it's really getting me fired up. But I'll see y'all in the next video. Peace. Peace.